Welcome to module 8 of the 12-hour MBA in Mining Company Valuations. And in this module we're going to have a look at the evaluation of a, a mineral project. Um, and specifically we're going to have a look at the intrinsic value of, of a mineral project using earnings and cash flow based valuation methodology. So if we have a look at the next graphic that's on the screen you'll see the, the investment profile of this investment for Fortress Investments. You'll see there that we were talking about the acquisition of 19.9% of the shares in Banro, the common stock. And there you'll see that would have cost $87 million. The Twangiza concession, in order to get into 50% of Twangiza, the Fortress would have had to kick in 50% um, of the costs of that project and pay 50% of the net present value. Where did that pre net present value come from? The next uh, slide that I've, I've put up on the screen, Banro, um, here's, the, here's the Twangiza net present value per the updated feasibility study. I think this was June um, 2009. Okay, so you'll see there at a gold price of $950. Remember the sensitivities we were talking about? Same table. At a, at a gold price of $950 and a discount rate of 10%, they were estimating the, the net present value at $333 million. So in our investment um, schedule, you'll see there half of $333 million, $165,500.